And after her visit to the LAPD, Attorney General Lynch joined Mayor Garcetti to kick off Summer Night Lights, a program that aims to keep young people busy and off the streets during the summer. Rasha Goel has more. LA City Mayor Eric Garcetti recently kicked off the Summer Night Lights program at the Highland Park Recreation Center. The program has been successful in helping to steer both youth and adults in a direction opposite to crime by creating activities for the community and keeping centers open up late during the summer hours. Summer Night Lights takes a rec center or a park in a neighborhood that's challenged with resources, with too much crime. It's bringing in the folks to run workshops on healthy cooking, silk screening, bike repair, bring in community resources to share information. U.S. Attorney General Loretta Lynch, who has been at the forefront of strengthening relationships between police and the community, says it's a joint effort between the city and its people. You have to have a strong community who raises problems. You have to have a strong community who asks questions. You have to have a strong community who says we'll work with you but here's what we need, and they come out and they support what people build together. As a councilman for the 13th District, Mayor Eric Garcetti then began a program called At the Park After Dark, which included sports and counseling programs for the local youth. Former Mayor Antonio Villaregosa adopted the program, calling it Summer Night Lights nine years ago, and expanded it into some of the most gang-infested parks in the city. Highland Park Recreation Center was one of the primary targeted locations since the start of the program. It all comes from having public space where we can gather safely to build community. I used to be a knucklehead myself, so this program has really helped me a lot. You know, it's helped me stay away from the streets. It's helped me find new friends, make a family with my, my youth squad. In this program, at 32 sites in Los Angeles and the San Fernando Valley, parks become a place of safety for the youth by providing meals, activities, and fun services for families. And all services are provided for free. I'm Rasha Goel for LA This Week. Parks close at 11 p.m. Wednesdays through Saturdays until August 6th. For an additional three weeks between August 12th and August 26th, the parks will be open on Fridays and Saturdays until 11 p.m.